just want them to be able to see the joy in the little boys' faces. That's what I'm trying to capture. That's why I do mostly candid shots, so you can just see how much they really love princesses and how great they feel. Nice. It's fun to be a princess because you can do whatever you want. You guys look kind of scary. My son does love superheroes and race cars, but he loves princesses just as much, if not more. He is into dressing up, and this is a really amazing opportunity where they embrace the child. Oh, thank you. I just saw Jace being himself. Try and look up at Merida, Jace. Being his weird, goofy little self, and he gets to share that weirdness with other people. Everyone deserves to feel beautiful like that, even if it's a little boy. Hi, my name is Kitty, and I believe boys can be princesses too. I used to run a princess party business, and we did a few parties for little boys, and I realized there wasn't really any representation for these boys that like princesses. When you look online, you know, princesses are marketed to girls. You never really see boys playing with princess things. So I thought, I have princesses, I have a camera, I can make the representation for these boys. I just put an ad online saying, hey, I'm starting this project, contact me. I was excited about taking pictures. So they'll pick which princesses out of the list of that are available. Merida is my favorite princess because she has a weapon. Ooh, he's getting fancy with it. Ariel is in his top five. I'm, I'm, it fluctuates. Every day is a different princess. <laughs> Sometimes I'll have a story for the princess to read. Always elegant, never rough housing, always nibbling. There he is. Sometimes the more energetic kids will have like a dance party. <laughs> seeing him play with the bubbles and embrace dancing and singing and, and karate chopping. I usually try and bring a prop or something that fits, like a seashell. How does it look? Like a queen. Like, like a, a queen. queen? I just kind of let them do whatever and I try and get like the cute pictures of them. Bring them a little bit lower. There you go, perfect. And then at the end, the princess gives them a little certificate that says honorary princess. Jace, you are hereby officially declared honorary princess. I think the most exciting part for Jace was being able to play with the weapons. He loves to shoot them a lot. Fire! I have a lot of people say they thought they were alone, that their kid was the only one. So it just makes me feel inspiration and just I feel like the love. At the end of the day, they're just kids who want to play and they want to play with whatever they want. Some of these kids have already grown out of their princess phase, the ones who have been in the project. Like we can say girls can be superheroes, they can be Spider-Man, they can be Sword, and nobody really bats an eye. Why do we allow it for girls but not for boys? And I'm so glad with projects like this, just embracing each unique moment and each unique quality about your children. They're kids. Let them be who they want to be. If they outgrow it, all right. If they don't, well, then you didn't stifle who they are. Boys can be princesses too.